13, aqui quem fala é o Leas, estou aqui no começo do vídeo para pedir duas coisas importantes aqui para vocês, para ajudar o canal. A primeira é deixar um like aí no vídeo, aqui embaixo, vai ajudar demais o feedback. E a segunda é se inscrever no canal, que estamos com a meta aí de 200 mil inscritos, fechou? Tamo junto, rapaziada, espero que curta o conteúdo aí, e é nóis! Galera, beleza? Aqui quem fala é Leas, tô aqui no começo do vídeo só pra apresentar pra vocês o Sesco Fest, mano, patrocinador fiel aqui do canal E graças à força de vocês liberaram mais um dólar pra todo mundo que utilizar o cupom Aleas Caso você queira depositar qualquer coisa e continuar aqui jogando aqui no site, mano, não esqueça de utilizar o cupom Aleas E utilize também o link, sempre o link da descrição, fechou? Tamo junto galera e bora pro vídeo Plenty of energy left in the tank. It's going to be the Jolies making their way towards lower B. Siren looking to open things up, and he suddenly does. Headshots are plenty now, as we're seeing three kills coming for Team Spira. Make it four, and Zevi, nothing he can do. The round over before it even starts here. Team Spira continue with this magnificent form we saw in the semi-final. Yeah, the pistols can just be absolute bloodbaths, right? They can come in, come in swinging, and just decapitate their opponents in the blink of an eye. And Zevi is nowhere near the rest of the battle. He is just biding his time. But Team Spirit are about to take him out with the two overrunners. <laughs> and it's Siren that's done it. Every oh player for Team Likely just going to soften up a few okay. opponents, but he puts it right between the eyes. Decapitation of PKL is up first. So, Bomb will be planted. Pain Gaming in a pretty decent position here. But have they considered the Patsy flank? Apparently not. They've got a massive man advantage here. But it's Skulls with a nice little flank. Takes a bit of a meal of it, but gets the kill in the end. And we will see now the big damage done. Magic's there with the MP9. This is looking quite good. Remember, they came into this with scouts and MP9s. We're seeing bodies fly all over the place. As we see it come down to just one player remaining half now, burning away on the bomb site. They seem to know where he is. And there it is. Team Spirit finished things off there. Lovely work, especially. Body shots. One even. Could get rid of it, but he has got help on the B ramp. And Patsy goes aggressive. Finally, Big Azara will best him. But remember, the B ramp for Chopper is controlled. And now he has to worry about the B site itself. Through the tunnels, they're charging out. PKL spots Chopper going towards the car. And they've ripped apart the B defense. They'll now put the bomb down. Yeah, that's the round over as well. You can see the CT's already retreating here. It's going to be wonderful back towards the. They will not be forgotten. Yeah, they will not be forgotten. And it's snuck out already. That's going to be hard out. And the flashbang somehow. Oh, he nearly gets really another stopping one. magics whatsoever. Oh. Zebby, well, he'll find his first frag of the game, but he drops that in now. And he could be taking a boatload. Chopper rotates in as well. Molotov deployed in his position, has to rotate out. A lot of damage inflicted, but trade's coming through. It's up to Chopper to work out. Does he want to go for another frag here or wait for the backup? Well, that's the bomb as well. He nearly got into an engagement with, but the bomb now crosses to the site. There's the backup option that he's gone for. And He's actually going to reposition through tunnels. You'll have a friend alongside of him. Obviously, it's wonderful to have a little bit of a look. Make sure no one gets through the double doors of the window. Yeah, I don't mind the look of this for Pain Gaming. Even though they're at a man disadvantage. One decent shot. Could be the difference maker, but not the best position here. PKL will be punished. And now this big Uzera, if he had more HP, he might fancy his chances there. And now they know exactly where he is. Very low on HP. Should just be a matter of time before they take him down. And there's a fifth round confirmed. Pretty comfortable. Has to be said there, Dinko. Yeah, the retake was good. Good decisive call from Chopper. Gives up the bomb plant, but they secure oh! the round. Let's go, wonderful. Starting to get into fifth gear now as he absolutely wrecks Zebi there in towards T spawn. He's not done yet, it seems. Turns away from the flashbang, fancies another go. Spots the player, and there's the second. Can he get out of here, though? Surely he's not good for a third. Skulls finally takes him down. Still with a four on three advantage. Skulls knows he has to do a little bit more here. Flashbang's decent, and that's going to work out for the second. Yeah, good work here. Skulls goes through the nose. Want to try and get that in ASAP, but here they come. Oh. Bomb goes down, follow up AG. He whips it, though. Flashbang to follow things up. I think he goes down, so it's actually a realistic scenario. Good Molotov, and that's going to be a kill for sure. Yeah, burn him away. Magic's now alone. A one versus two. It is winnable for a player of Magic's caliber. There is a kit on the right side he can pick up, too. Now he's got that. It is an HE. And one player is low. If it is to connect underneath the window. Oh, but Skulls just creeps down below. And Magic's is to try and bolster this A defense. It's just one player in lower tunnel chopper. Seeing if there's anything going on. But it's all about the attack forward now for Pain Gaming. Looking to try and break through this A defense. And a couple of important kills found for the Brazilians. Patsy upon the boost. Gets one to keep them level. And the bomb yet to go down. Hards out. Looking to plant. So he does oh! so through the box though, the headshot delivered once again, this boost is an absolute nightmare to deal with, running out of time and space at this stage, here's Zevi, 
as he'll try and defend Big Uzera, who's looking down from above, and it's all collapsed here, Dinko. Yes. With a chance, but it's not meant to be, and it will be yet another round 14 spirit, and it looked like that was falling apart for them. The boost working out twice. Smoke's creating the force field. Slowly coming back in from Team Spirit. PKL is going to dive down into CT, and with the chaos, he can move forward quite swiftly, but he looks the wrong way. Patsy and Wonderful getting kills between them. Patsy burns away, but Wonderful still standing and still ready to fight. As the 25 seconds continue to tick on, Hardzal will commit to the plant. And Zevi's wor worried about the flank, and for good reason, Henry, here they come. Good shot, though. Can he find a second? Apparently not. Very ah. slim chance, hearts out, can do it and get out of hand very quickly with these tech nine. You can see just firing off those shots at the start, trying to suggest that there's no player booted up, and there's a lovely shot from Wonderful, doesn't miss many of them. We're into the three versus two, but now they can to win this round. Well, Skulls is just gonna hold it, watching the doorway, it's big as Eros from Mass that deals with the first Skulls peaks with him, and now it's all Wonderful. Can't I think he's realized he can't do this one, he cannot achieve the retake so he's leaving he will get one on the way out the door he's taking party. long as siren is tagged upon the cross and here comes the five seven flash combo mp9 there as well oh no oh, oh no, no indeed no. it's a lot of kills no, inside of the like tunnels this. and wonderful has found one elsewhere not the crunch yeah, from up yeah. so it's pretty much the exact same approach this this time with the mp9 leading the charge i, I love the way team spirit are this is now a little bit problematic. Oh! A deagle headshot from hell. That was speedy from Skulls. Right towards Wonderful. And that allows space and time and the bomb plant. Maybe even a chance at the round here. But Patsy has other ideas. Headshot on the bigger Zera. Rifle now passes the hand. Oh, into the hands of Skulls. He's got another one. Zevi right through the smoke. This is an important round for Pain to convert. They must hold on now. Chopper and Magix are going down. And that's it. Magix in the pit. Pain with the round, that came out of nowhere. It really to did. As much as possible in this T half. And here come the smokes for the cross. CT completely smoked off, and they're gonna try and B split this. There's one player in the tunnels, so the main point of attack is coming up the ramp. And Bigger Zara has ripped right through Siren. One player left in the sight, the chopper butchers two into the ground. And that should be enough to at least keep them competitive. But the bomb goes down, and Pain Gaming will still be feeling pretty good about this. Yeah, I think you're dead on. They actually probably have a bit of an advantage here. It's once again there, the retake of the two M4s and the AWP. Because he's kind of vacated the area, it's quite easy for them to be split right now. They're trying to take every weapon away. It's actually Team Spirit who come well, out on top of that. Here comes the final B play. Double for Just with the masses, yeah, that's not ideal. Job that's completely blind here as well. Normally good for a oh. couple. The fam is spraying through. It's a no scope from Wonderful to keep them in the round, but another disappointing situation to be in. You've got to retake this, the last round of the half. You've got to go for it at least. Zevi's got a pick. He's still close. Knows that Magix has to be drawn into the opening. Three players looking at him. It's now just wonderful coming through the tunnels. Good luck. Maybe one kill to pass the stats a little bit, but this one ain't doable. No scope down from Zevi. And that's a fantastic recovery in the half from Pain. Yeah. That actually pushes the CTs further back. They're not getting a lot of info. And now Team Spirit begins to fight in mid. It's Zevi who draws first blood in the second half. Skulls' his turn. And it's a massacre this time for Pain Gaming in the pistol. Wonderful and Magix, the only two players left. And what can they really hope to do here? It was Team Spirit that found the clean sweep in the first half pistol and getting a a taste of their own medicine, and it looks pretty bitter to me, and it's just wonderful with the PT-50 in hand. Uh, has got himself some Kevlar as well, but this would be a miraculous play, and there it is, the absolute clean sweep. You can see what it means to the boys. No Lane towards short side here for Pain Gaming. The first kill, in fact, comes from a fight. Skulls just takes a confident fight against Magix at long, and now Team Spirit are worried they could get flanked, so they're going quite quickly into this A site. Zevi. Zevi. Yeah, he's got to do his absolute best here. Patsy, opportunity for the double kill, but the man advantage will stay with Pain Gaming here. Speculative shots, Siren trying to shut them down, but the smoke's blocking his vision. Oh, no, oh. chop up. He does get the kill eventually, but could have been a little bit cleaner. Can he find the second and make up for it? They pull a frag back, and now three on three. Could go either way. Bomb yet to commit out of short. Siren making the space, making it feel a little bit more comfortable. But Wonderful doesn't want to leave short side because there could be a flank oh, coming. Because the bottom is back and Wonderful is cognizant of the fact there is a player behind him. But dealing with him is a different matter altogether. He's trying no to allow way. Siren to help him out. But Hardstyle is using the stairs perfectly to get a kill with the MP9. 
It is now Wonderful who is very low and Chopper on 100 HP to try and deal with these two MP9s. That MP9 doing a boatload of damage there. They might be able to boost up the smoke and find Wonderful who's got low HP. Very vulnerable themselves though. MP9 the range not known to be the best, but uh, we'll see what they can make of it. Bomb ticking at some pace and they do have kits. Well, and the wow. MP9 doing it That's once again. That's a high health player. It's just wonderful left. And from Goose, he cannot do it. Getting to the defuse is PKL. He has a kid on his back. He's got the round. And that is unbelievable that Payne win that one. That's back in uh, admirable fashion. It's going to be wonderful, though, with the AWP. The Zevi strikes first. He finds Patsy through the smoke. AT's being received. It's going to be a double. That could take him down. Hardzell, though. M4 and Incendiary waiting for them. Will they be able to penetrate and pull around back here? Mikhail, once again, just fragging from the same position. He's a mounted turret at this point. He's looking for another one. His teammate is gone, so all the pressure and focus is on him, but he handles it for another one. Zevi dives down into the side, and he off oh. is so quick, so here clean. Here he comes. And a tap on the chest because he knows what he's just done. 12 rounds. He's here to the sniper, making sure he can deploy a one way if required. Buy himself some more time. Flashbang going over. Probably will take a peek off this. Can't spot the head, but it's going to be Siren to open things up. Is that the cue to go? Vivid. It's not fully through yet for Team Spirit. They're held back behind some fire, but now starting to make their way past those smokes. Limited amount of time to get onto the site. And they're right in the midst of some chaos. It's about to unfold around the edges of the smoke. It is Patsy for his skulls. Down to the Galil. And rolling out the guillotine finally here, Team Spirit. They sentence a couple of players here to death, but I think it might just be the safe call on Pain Gaming fleeing the scene. Yeah. Spirit finally went around. It was a, a scrappy affair, but they managed to keep everyone alive. Well, there we have it. Round confirmed. Much needed one as well. Breaks the spell. Heavy once more with the AWP. Clean shot there. Is dodging the flashbangs in a lovely fashion and working in tandem with Big Uzera. They just get mowed down upon arrival. Overwhelming finish here from Team Spirit. They don't even really inflict any damage whatsoever. Sirens to be dropped as well. And Chopper. What's happened to this team? They were running away with this in the first half. And Chopper, the in-game leader, looking to step up here, but they're receiving so much utility and bullets. Bodies loitering as we see them try and break out of the double doors here. This is an absolute nightmare for them. One by one, they're going down. That's wonderful as well. Oh. Great sequence from Big Uzera. Absolutely decimating his opposition with the AK-47. Here comes Team Spirit charging out with the pistols. Magics, a rifle at least. Got the pick. There it is, recovering the M4. Oh, oh wow. Nice shot. Wonderful tried to get the safety in the pit, but Zevi watched for the cross and over. He is sharp today. Magic's really trying to find some impact here. It's another kill for Magic's. Leverage to speak of. AWP for Chopper's draw. Oh, that's a missed miss shot. shot. A massive missed shot. That's the round. No way Magic can do anything with this. Two players survive, and there we have it. Map point. PKL. Look at his position right now. He's so advanced in mid. There's no way, surely, that Patsy should have won that, but he did. He's come out on top, and he's got the advantage for a, sh oh. for a short while. The Ned finds him. Yeah, well, they'll take that, considering how that was looking, but Siren. He predicts the upper B reaction there. And we'll see now Skulls. He could get a big spray down. He Bingo. really could. But coming around, it's not an easy angle to clear out. He's destined to get one. But Chopper and Wonderful extending the advantage here for teams. We'll see if Pain Gaming can find the, the killing blow here. They will save the AWP. But the Molotov should take care of that. Back they go. Nice swing out from Patsy. So that's uh, kind of a multi-use. Molotov, if you will, because not only does it push close range CTs back behind the steps, but you can also use the incandescence of the flames there to make it very difficult to see you on the swing, right? So, very nice stuff. And Patsy gets the opening frag, and uh, this might be the full commitment towards the A side. The one way smoke allowing Maddis to get a little bit of vision there down towards CT spawn, and this boost, oh, will they be ready for it? Find it. This wonderful gives the haircut PKL no longer with us as we now look at the 25 second mark. Team Spirit will look for the plant. Team <coughs> of this caliber, wonderful. Of course, the, one, the AWP still was seven thousand dollars. Money, not too much of an issue. This stage one round will do it, of course. So, just winning every single one in front of you—that's the aim of the game. Four players survive, and yeah, you can see they're starting to feel it now. They know they can do this. They're capable. 
It's been and a rough we'll see Uzera and Zebi with the opportunity to close this one out right here, right now. Eight seconds remaining. Can they do it? First kill is going in their favor. Wow, the bomb's loose. They it's can't win it. the round. They cannot win the round anymore. And Pain Gaming are going to be taking it. Map number one goes their way. And Team Spirit. Have a look at the approach from Team Spirit as they kick things off here on Nuke. It's going to be Zebby with first contact. Takes a bullet to the face. It has to pull back. And there's another one opening pick for Team Spirit in the form of Wonderful. And down towards Secret they go. They've used Kit just to note on the back of PKL. So if the bombers get planted, they do have a chance at the retake. But for now, there's dual Barrettas finding the bomb towards main entrance. What a shot that is. Cracking skulls outside. We are going to see it go down to a three versus one. Just Chopper remains after a great seconds. They know what a good TV start means to them, and they've got that chance now. And they do. Outside smoke's deployed and sending two oh. players towards outside. It's the main entrance, though. Apathy comes out on top, but he doesn't anticipate the swing for that MP9. We have got one player towards the T-Vent. Skull's chiming in once again, but down towards Secret. Chopper stampeding through the back halls here. In terms of the bomb, it's on the back of Wonderful. Who was silenced in that second half. It was Zevi taking the lion's share of the orb frags, and... Speaking of which, he's in a prime position to detect this player towards window. He's willing to fight, but it costs him his life. Back to a three on three. Piki Aldo maintaining the man advantage, but Hard Zhao needs to be very careful. He can't challenge too aggressively, considering he's only got the SMG. He needs to wait for the backup. Bomb to be planted. And we have a winnable situation. Wonderful. And Chopper both very healthy. Oh. Even more so now as he hit us. Well, certainly so. In a moment, Chopper swings open the doors. No one's sticking it yet. Wonderful begins to pre-fire PKL with a headshot, but the time is ticking too far now. Wonderful just needs to stay alive. He can get a kill on the way out. Insult to injury. He'll get in the corner as well and save his rifle. And there we have it. It's going to be Patsy who's made his way down, taking minimal damage. Can't say the same for Siren and Magic, so they get absolutely destroyed. Upon He's going to be crossing, a bullet whizzes past his head, he has been spotted. And they're going to be going down into lower PKL from the vent though. Puts Patsy down and Good at Molotov's right. off. Wonderful as well. Yeah, so a 5 on 2. Gets himself another Molotov there as well. Chopper, Let's see what he can do. But uh, looks like a guaranteed frag for Skulls, continuing that good form. 5 versus 1, wonderful. Not much to report here. If he can save the orb, that'll be something because Considering how expensive that previous round was, they are going to be in dire straits. The loss bonus won't be established whatsoever. And he probably gets his kill. PKL going down, but time is of the essence. Three seconds. Wants to guarantee he doesn't go down, but that actually could happen. He's a sort of player that nails his sort of... I've got wonderful patrolling outside of the AWP. CTs just with PKL down, and there's wonderful striking. And bringing it back to a 4-on-4, four four. that means it's the full investment. Oh, PKL. Can he get something done here? The Molotov is certainly going to heap things up. Gives away his position on the opening of the double doors. We'll try and fake out the window. In fact, not just faking out the window, going into the window room. Here we go. And Wonderful's got another one. A wall bang this time on Zevi. Well, they will continue with their assault down on the lower bomb site. Man advantage now. It's still really up to PKL. Gives up his position with the thrown grenade. And he might not be aware they'll open the squeaky door any second. And this is looking very rough for him. He's under so much pressure, his rotation isn't good enough, and PKL will go down to AWP. Well, Skull's had a fantastic start to the game. It's quieting down a little bit. Maybe this is the round to reignite the fire. He's got one. The catacombs certainly not being filled just yet, but now come the kills. It's Zevi and Bigazera. We're getting most of the frags here for the Brazilian oh, side, but Patsy's oh. machine nearly turns around to win it, but just about stolen away. Zevi, with it all to do, 30 seconds. Big Usera will. Hard's out down the dark with it. Big oh. Usera trying to assist. It's quite a heavy setup down in the lower bomb side, but no kills yet. It has to be Hard Cell to use the distraction. But the T's, they're still going. They're trying to pass the bomb, but here it comes. Hard Cell out with a double. The bomb is loose. The time is ticking. 10 seconds. It's done on kills. Hard Cell with a 4K. What a machine. If you let them go down B, you're in a real tough spot. Need to funnel them into the A side in the final 30 seconds. And PKL on the double kill. Magix and Siren both go down. 27 okay. seconds. This, this could get chaotic. The bomb's actually back in T-spawn right now. That's on the back. Another play for wonderful. elimination. I think it's <laughs> this is the game right now. Pl try and play for elimination. Play for the kills. 15 seconds. They're going into the A site. Oh. They will get the kills. Wonderful and Chopper bring down two. Chopper, oh. how have you done that? That's so dirty. That's yeah, a sick shot.
gets around. Zevi's just down and hard's out. He needs to hold on the ramp, but he knows there's a possibility he could be pushed from hell side too. So he's just going to drop down and play inside of the B side. Remember, Big Uzera did start to a secret, so it can help out on B, but that's just not aware from Skulls. Just completely exposed himself down below, and all the kills coming in for Team Spirit. Wonderful runs back. This is uh, turned into a bit of a nightmare for Pain Gaming after the pistol victory. The second round follow-up, they just haven't had much to say. Any rounds they have garnered have just fallen apart in the subsequent follow-up. And uh, well, the door the starts. He's smoking off main, flashing as well, while his teammates get ready to attack outside. Who'll be drawing first blood? It's likely to be the CTs. Oh. oh my goodness. Wonderful. Just absolutely mowing them down there. Three kills with the USP. He gets his 16th thrag of the game. It's going to be just Big Uzera. I mean, he's got no armor, just a flash now. That one. Unraveling at the seams once again. Siren, dual elites, hasn't really had to do anything with them just yet. Might be given the opportunity to close things out. Yeah, it seems Spirit have had a lot of pistol runs in this tournament that has just been non-existent for the opponent. It's just absolute destruction. And wonderful as a man to get it done towards outside. Ready to hold down Mouse One. It's not just the chopper show though. He has got his teammates down the bottom of the stairway in Patsy. Unleashed again. A good double. Couldn't get out the door, and he's frustrated about that, but he's calling for the help of Magix, and he gets one at least. But 10 seconds, you have to start planting real soon towards the back of the site. And Zevi is going to get the bomb down with enough time, and it actually puts it all onto Siren. A one versus two. Very true. Just uh, lots to learn, lots to look back on, but Siren, the first kill, but it's short lived. In terms of the advantage, he's actually triggered out almost immediately in Patsy. Uh, don't shoot your own teammate, and oh, the nades come soaring in to finish him off. Zebby's done some work, but Patsy makes up for it. The bomb indeed. Wow. And now a one versus two. A winnable one versus two. This could be the flank. Yeah, this could be problematic. Does he check his close left? He does. Secures the round and leads they force him down. And will they be trying to get out the squeaky door? Patsy doesn't seem to think so. That's the first kill going in his favor. Five or four. Famous. Ringing true, Patsy finds his second. Oh wow, a lot of damage there. This, this might be done already. As we go 13 to 8, it's been a, a long old save here, but uh, it will come through. Yeah. Damage connected, but they've detected a reload here, but it's all about the bait and switch. His teammate here with him. Magix will be able to get away with this one as well. Maybe even one more kill for good oh. luck. But look how low they are. Yeah, that's a problem. They always take so much damage in these rounds. Pin yeah. down just... Walking wounded, 9 HP on both of them, and Patsy's got <laughs> another kill. He's just farming. Yeah, he really is feeling himself, isn't he? So, Big Uzera, as we mentioned, 5 kills, 18 depth. This would be yeah, a phenomenal yeah. effort if he somehow does something with this. All this would, would be, be the given. comeback of the century. <laughs> he's able he might to pull be able to get the first. Off. Patsy won't be aware that he's slightly above him, perhaps. So that's maybe a guaranteed frag. There we go, it is. It absolutely is. But he needs a bit here. more than that. He knows that. Yeah, so he wants to get deep into the site. He actually knows where the second player is, so he's going to wait for the double doors. If he's quick to react here, if he gets his pick and then flicks down to Patsy. Yeah, but like the silence is deafening. They'll be suspicious at one yeah. point. They're not, oh, they're not overextending. Yeah, very well disciplined here. Big Uzera so frustrating for him. Just wants yeah. to find that second player. Oh, now he's, got it. now he's gone. He doesn't even get the kill on Patsy. Yeah. He, may, he was going for the percentage <coughs> to win the round. Yeah. I respect it. Uh, it's just unfortunate. One AK-47. He's happy with the advantage he's managed to pick up. So shouldn't be too much of an issue here. It will be Magic's confirming the round even further. Big Uzera pulls one back, but that's it. Just a Tech-9. Kevlar maybe gets one kill, but not meant yeah. to be. Why not? Change things up. Molotov's going in. A bit of damage upon arrival. Will the big spray down come through? It certainly will. Chopper with two massive frags there. But Skulls answering back. That's not bad. They've actually got the man advantage here, but Magic steals it away back to a two on two. Grenades coming in as well. Big damage there. And uh, the boat. The vent is currently occupied by Skulls. Magic spots the head and Wonderful gets the other headshot. That's a quick <coughs> finish. Right to the bomb. Should be enough time with the kit. They're going to stick it through. Ooh. And Team Spirit, it's close, but have they got it? They have. 16 8. This grand final is evened out again. 1 3 1. In the Let's see, we'll force the issue as far as he can. Bomb planted already. It's crazy how easy this has been so far. Finally, Patsy stops. Zemi gets a double kill. All right. Yes, you've considered the bomb plant, but you've got the kit in your back. You've still got some utility. You've got incendiary. They've got smoke and a flash to try and get back into this. And there are a player or two up.
So, up to Chopper now, trying to find the kills upon arrival, but they can't get anything going. This is very clean. And his AWP, can you believe it? Oh, Sevi, that is too heavy to handle. Magix comes in with a double kill. Headshot in and threw the smoke on hard cell. Pico Zero at least fighting back a little bit, but Team Spirit have forced their way into the bomb site and have planted the bomb. Pain Gaming nowhere to be seen, and Patsy is trying to get behind. He might just get this pick quickly, two body shot. Strikes them down, his chopper to crack things open. Continuing that strong form we saw on Nuke, and they answer right back here. Three players surviving, they pick up the AWP Trolling as well. To fend them off, Figuzera with the challenge right now, spanning off shots, but he's gonna be taken down here. Chopper, insane oh. sequence there with the glow. Go for it, it would take something absolutely catastrophic to happen, but there's the first step completed. Skulls, we'll take down Siren, but that's about all that's looking to happen at this stage. Yeah, a frag there, but wonderful. He'll put the round to bed. Let's chop up. So, uh, always a lot of fun to pick that up on the T side. Four and four, still a chance here. It was the opening frag for Pain Gaming, but quickly snatched away that lead, and the four and four does well, favor. It comes down to this. Right now, it's a fight at top ramp. Chopper gets away with another one, but it's two for the Pain Gaming side. So they're actually in the lead in terms of players at the final 50 seconds. Yeah. Overall HP, though, does favor Team Spirit whatsoever. Now, are they aware they're already passed? Oh dear. Oh, oh, dear, dear, oh, dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Chopper with a 4K. Yikers. How, is, how have they just let that happen? What a machine. Well, that's the thing. Well, they dropped he's the getting that one for one every single time. This is the re-aggression. PKL's turn wonderful. Holds him off. The aggression doesn't work. And Magix gets the second kill. It's an absolute massacre again here on the ramp. And it's just Skulls left. He's nowhere near the battle. Yeah, he's all the way on the other side of the map, unfortunately. So presumably the bomb planted momentarily as top of the scoreboard is going to be Vigo Zero, but Skull's dropped another lovely shot from Chopper. He just wants to get this one done as quickly as possible yeah, now, same one. Yeah, they've been really solid at this, and there just hasn't been much resistance <laughs> whatsoever. <laughs> just, them out. There's nowhere to stand. No. There's just fire across the floor. It's, it's Dante's we, we Inferno. We saw this at Pro League. Chad and I were casting a lot of the Team Spirit games, and this is something we talked about a lot. This B execution time and time again. It's so overwhelming, stifling utility. Yeah. And, uh, but they've actually done pretty good here. You're just witnessing your own demise. You can do nothing about it. And... Uh, yeah, the orb might be hunted down here, might as well with the MAC-10. So there we go, trying to push back this mid-assault presented by Team Spirit. And we'll be Patsy to open things up once again. Surely this kill is going in favor of PKL, but it's not. And now just two players remain, Skulls and Hards out. Oh, again, they are actually sniffing around T-Spawn. Yeah. But uh, they're actually not to be seen. So they will hold on to the weapons here. The second shot, but... It's just turning into an absolute destruction in this round already. Wonderful with the wall bang. Patsy with his third, or rather second kill of the round. And that's the third kill overall for Team Spirit. It's now one minute left and they have full control of the round. Should the referee be ending this one? They're, yeah, not, they they're not defending throw themselves. Throw in the towel, throw yeah. in the towel. <laughs> Towards that ladder room, I believe, once more. Might as well. And uh, that's the dream of five rounds gone. Because we go to level to this first pick spots, the barrel of one. Oh, he's already got past. It's a guaranteed frag. There it is. Oh, oh, it's double as well. Gotta love it. Two kills again. <laughs> God. It's just uh, unstoppable. Four versus three. The wonderful. Alongside his teammates. Looking to bring her down upon them. But a missed shot. A rare missed shot. That's a chance there for Hardzow. Flash is going to allow Magix to peek on out and I'm sure he'll be finding at least one here. He's often precise in finding his victims. Doesn't really leave a lot of witnesses as Siren helps him out. His partner in crime leaving Skulls to ooh, pick away at the scraps. Hello. In fact, a double kill. Skulls in a wild position. Just give himself a real shot at a second for round here for Pain Game. He's just going to stick the defuse, trying to get the round. Chopper, so close, but not going to be happening. At least another round. There we go. Close position cleared out. Smoke's actually just smacked off the body of Patsy. He won't be going through it. So he'll regroup with his teammate. That's your PKL draws the opener. And Zevi on the double up. Big Gazera falls victim again to the sniper of Wonderful. And we are in a two versus three. Both the remaining Team Spirit players are low on health. Yeah, absolutely. Looking a bit better now for Pain Gaming. 11 4. Won't be ideal, but uh, certainly a lot better than 14 1. As we see Skulls pretty much confirmed the round here. Just wonderful remaining. Might as well go for it, see what he can do with it. 
Try and uh, add to the highlight reel. But that uh, will be skulls to close things out there. Come on, lads. Final map of the competition. Will Paint Gaming put together four. And will Team Spirit leave the half with a scoreline of 12 to 3. It's fast up the ramp. Committing into the fight early on. Because Zera peeks out from behind the sandbags and gets a second too. Good start to the round is wonderful, able to snap back. It's not quite enough to draw them back to even odds, though. Yeah, where was this at the start of the half? Well, rounds looming if they can complete this one. PKL watches the extension out. Magix does provide the opportunity for the kill. The damage being done for sure. For not a kill, though, it is wonderful. That has everything to do. He's got three kills. This should be the ace, Henry, if he can pull this one off. He's got the fourth. Switches to the right. He wants to close this on the low health player. Oh, oh he's got the ace. 12 <laughs> rounds, all five kills. And this is looking locked in. Team Pain Gaming will be shipped off. Comes out. Skulls leading the charge. Skulls with a double. Opens up the pistol quite swiftly here for Pain Gaming. A lot of space gained. Yeah, looking very good. Not over just yet, but maybe Ooh, it is skulls. now. Skulls with a hat trick. Asserting his dominance there with the Glock down to 12 HP. They're actually planting towards B as well. So, again, <laughs> beautiful pistol rounds. I mean, the pistol Excellent rounds certainly pistols. cool, yeah. But other than that, not much done. But the pistol being picked up, it's the step you have to take. Lots of steps to come after, but the first one has been found. It's cleared out. Very convincing pistol round. be an option for them, but need to get past this from Ass first, which... He'd spot it. Oh, God. Oh, oh right. No. Oh, no, indeed. Chopper's D, Sirens from Mass, and now surely Patsy's AK. Lovely peek out who gets away with that one, but still a very good position here for Team Spirit. Now, bear in mind, if they do lose this round, it's going to be 13 to 5, and after losing all but one of their weapons in the previous, their money will be shattered once more. Magics. Oh, he gets this kill. Oh, he's sneaking around perfectly. Couldn't have done any better there. And gets uh, the upgrade. Yeah, it's round. Uh, PKL left on 10 HP. <laughs> it's all from that damage in the previous. Look at the cash. And the flank here from Patsy, too. He's got just 10 points of health, and that uh, yeah, should be a done deal. Straight to the dome. Make no mistake. Oh, look at that. Magix just positions himself perfectly. Looks out to the left side. Because Zero, the victim of his rifle, and Hansa overruns him. Tech Knight goes in with a headshot. Siren from the back of the generators. Counting another kill here for Spirit. Three players left for Pain. Make it two with Patsy's kill added to the tally. Siren swinging it around. PKL. That's a pretty good one. And Sevi snaps back in too. A two versus two out of this. Yeah, not too bad, all things considered. A realistic chance of potentially picking this one up. And they've had to fight two for now to make it possible. Grenades being deployed now. Sevi incredibly low. They won't be planting anytime soon. Just above the smoke now going for the plant in the open if the swing comes around he's in a lot of trouble and there it is the swing leads us to a one versus one wonderful up against pk smoke he That's, has he can just smoke the bomb look where it is it's not really planted for the stairs either i'm wonderful i just get on this tap it at least draw them into the open but he's a tap and then just get the kill and if this could be the moment goes into the fight double kill sets his team up on the perfect platform but a two versus two is Zevi and PKL fighting it back. Who holds the gap? Sees a victim, but wow! I did not see Zevi come around that corner. <clears throat> Can Magix close things out here? Two versus one, not meant to be just yet. Zevi will hold on. Yep. And Skull's opening things up. A double kill now for Pain Gaming. The last round is always the hardest one to find. Oh, absolutely. You'll always see a little mini come back or an extension of the, the game. There's no doubt in my mind, eventually Team Spirit will be taking this one away. It's just a matter of when. Okay, throwing the uh, AK out the map there, Zebby. Pete from PKL. Wonderful. We're getting to the grand final. I don't think anybody expected. Well, there's definitely a world in which I, I see it happening, but. Thinking Imperial, that wasn't the most expected. Yeah, that is. Wonderful. A devastating headshot there with the Desert Eagle. Finds Zevi. Still can close things right here, right now with the M4s, to be honest, Tinko. They're certainly capable. But that Desert Eagle, wonderful as well. There's a chance, and even more so now, there's a big kill towards PKL. They've actually got the man advantage as they're funneled in towards the B bomb site. Who's going to be lying in wait? It's going to be 
the big man chopper. Get to the chopper. Here he goes. Rotors start spinning, and unfortunately, not fast enough. Skulls. What an extend play, perhaps here. Good flash in from Hartzell. Wonderful's Deagle peeks on out with some body shots, and look who's arriving. It's Patsy, who's been a nightmare for them. A nightmare, but it's not going to happen. Hartzell wakes up from his sleep paralysis. Can they hold on though? PKL towards the save round takes a lot of damage on Rue. Patsy finds a man advantage. This is the round where they close things out. Bomb to be planted here. Zevi answers back to a four and four, and he's controlling the rotations here with the AWP. In towards connector now, and Big Uzera up. He's got a massive advantage here. He'll be able to take two players down potentially. They won't have time to check it. Oh, 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 now they're aware, and it will be Skulls to find the man advantage, and then some. Not well, going to be closing things out here. That's nuts from Skulls. You got to love that. Wonderful under pressure. Yeah, you're right. Not going to be closed out here. Play extended further. Zevi and Skulls that are really lighting up the scoreboard now. Well, we got a full buy at least, you know. And maybe an opening frag indeed. Magics with that saved AK-47. This could be where it all comes crashing down for Pain Gaming. A valiant effort here in the last few oh, rounds. Patsy. But now we're getting to that point. A five on three. Looking to crown a champion here at the Fire League Global Finals. I don't think they'll be able to do much about this one now. There is damage inflicted towards Chopper and Magics. Great effort. Managed to make it a respectable scoreline for sure. It would take a bit of a miracle now to recover this deficit. Molotov coming in toward the sandbag position, hoping to find a cheeky kill. Give them some footing into the round, but all three players here. Molotov's exchange. Patsy with the AWP, if he hits this shot, call it done. He smoked out for now though, but still maintains the vision, misses the shot, has to fall back. Well, he's holding for it, good kill here for Patsy, goes in again, but it's hard out, but it's not going to be enough. Zevi is the only player left standing between Team Spirit and their $100,000, and they are surely going to get it. Zevi looking to play spoiler, but there's 20 seconds left, there's no real ground here. He's going to be spotted, they know where he is, just seconds away, just a bit of help left. And Spirit have done it. They've taken the Fire League Global Finals. They are your champions, and they've got $100,000 heading into the major. They're feeling really good about this one. Yeah.